on shares of Microsoft today. Uh, looks like we're heading, did we finish lower on there? Yep, down about, we'll call it four tenths of a percent. That's after uh, product chief Panas Panay is stepping down, according to Bloomberg. He will join Amazon.com to run the unit responsible for the firm's Alexa and Echo products. Yahoo Finance's Dan Howley is joining us now for more on this. So Dan, walk me through this news. What'd you make of it? Yeah, it's actually very surprising news. Uh, we have Microsoft set to host an event on the 21st uh, to unveil what uh, is expected to be some new Surface products. And Panos uh, was basically one of the uh, leaders of that unit that got Microsoft's hardware off the ground and going, those, those Surface devices. Uh, he then became uh, the head of Windows uh, as well. So the, the fact that he's stepping down at this point uh, really is a, a shock. And also, uh, you know, part of the Bloomberg report also says that he may be going over to Amazon to fill Dave uh, Limp's position. He's leaving Amazon's hardware division uh, after the shakeups that the, that had seen following the layoffs from the company. So there's reports that Panos may end up going over to Amazon and fill that role. Uh, you know, like I said, this is a very uh, big change for the company. Um, they do say that they're still wholeheartedly behind the surface line of products. Uh, and, you know, as I said, there's there's expected to be some uh, of those new pieces of hardware announced later this week. And then what kind of bench does Microsoft have here? I mean, as you, as you know, I mean, a big name here leaving. Do they have a bench they can count on to pick up the slack? Yeah, I mean, look, the thing about Panos uh, was or is that he's very charismatic uh, when he hosts these events where he shows off his uh, devices or, or the devices from Microsoft, he really is, you know, going out and, and kind of proselytizing for the brand. Uh, and he's done that very well. Uh, you know, I think that moving forward, they do have uh, executives in place that are going to be taking over, take, taking over those roles, excuse me. Uh, but really, you know, I think uh, above all, he was a, a panel's a very good showman for Microsoft. And look, when they, they rolled out the Surface line of devices, uh, you know, this was based, that was basically Microsoft's way of saying to the PC market in general, look, this is how you can make PCs that look great and run really well. Um, and so, you know, if you look at a Surface device, uh, whether it's the, the two-in-one, the, the tablet uh, style uh, that has the keyboard or the actual Surface laptops, uh, they look fantastic. And, you know, they can go head to head uh, with Apple, which for a while was really the only brand that was selling hardware that looked great. Microsoft came out with the Surface line, said this is the way it's done, and then uh, OEMs started to follow suit. Now you have all of these great looking uh, devices on the market as a result of that. So that, you know, part of that was was uh, Panos is doing. And so we'll, we'll just have to see if they, they stay on uh, with the Surface line of products in the long term. Uh, and then what this means for Windows and, and the products that are gonna be coming out uh, from that division as well. All right, covering all things tech for us, Dan Howley, thank you for your time.